What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. This is Brian. It's been a while since I've uploaded a new video. Uh, we've been getting crazy weather here in the Midwest. Uh, a lot of ice, a lot of frigid temperatures, and uh, so I haven't been riding as much. Um, so my bad, but I'm definitely hoping for better weather. Today was a very nice day in the mid 50s here in the Midwest. Uh, so I'm glad about that. But in today's video, um, I want to add this uh, brake light to my R here. Um, we're gonna go ahead and put it on. I I got this from Luminate, and I also got uh, the adapter that is gonna go to the battery because I'm gonna use this brake light along with my headlight, and I'm gonna use the same battery to power this. So appreciate you guys uh, coming back for another video. If you subscribe here lately, thanks for the support. And for those of you who've been subscribed to the channel here for a minute, um, Good to see you guys again and uh so let's get into this video all right guys so these are the stuff that i got in the set um i did buy this uh y adapter because i'm gonna use um the same battery here for my headlight i'm gonna go ahead and uh, use it to power on both headlight and brake light like i said so i have the y splitter here uh, it comes with uh, two male ends and and the female side that's gonna go inside the battery. And then I have this adapter, which this end, these three pins are gonna go in here. And so that's how we're gonna set it up. Uh, so yeah, that's all that I got. Let's get into it. All right, so this is pretty simple. I'm gonna connect this Y splitter to the battery. And the headlight end, I'm gonna connect it here on one of these ends, okay? And we're gonna test the brake light before we finish installing it on the actual bike frame. Uh, so let's see. Hey, there you go. That's pretty cool. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and mount this over here on the actual frame. And uh, it's supposed to bend pretty easily uh, because I have the controller for the R. When I press the brakes, the, the brake light won't work, but it will always be on though. And uh, I'm okay with that. I think it's a little bit cleaner than using the, the little flashing lights that I was using, but I'm still gonna add, and I'm gonna leave some of these on the bike uh, because they're more the matter, I think, especially when I'm riding late at night or maybe early in the morning on my way to work. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish this up and I'll show you guys the end results. so this is what I have so far I have the battery we have the Y adapter here went ahead and I looped the extra cable on the center mole uh, ran the cable through here put a zip tie here and the cable runs here on the side of the bike to the tail bike so yeah that's uh, pretty much it shouldn't be too much of a hassle uh, I'm ready to to ride soon man so please stick around definitely uh looking to upload more videos soon all right guys so so far i have it on i do have these two velcro straps on the tail light and we'll see if maybe just adhesive just just needs time to really stick to the to the frame i know the frame is pretty cold right now because the uh, temperatures outside are starting to drop uh, so that could be part of the adhesive not sticking so well to it uh, but so far this works for now uh, we'll see 
if I need to keep them on or uh, I don't know, maybe it'll, it'll dry and it'll stick real well to the frame. So, you know, we'll find out. We'll see, but for now, uh, let me just show you guys right quick. Hey, that looks nice. It looks clean. Uh, I like it. Uh, definitely a good buy. And with this adapter, I'm gonna be able to use both headlights and brake lights at the same time. I don't have to invest in a new controller or you know anything else. So definitely, uh, if you're looking to save and not change too much on the controller or the battery end, then uh, I think this can work really well for you. Uh, let me know your comments and what you guys think of this light. I think it's super clean. I've seen them in other videos and pictures before. And so I'm glad that I was able to get my hands on, on uh, these finally because they happen to be in stock uh, at least 30 days ago when, when I purchased this. So appreciate you guys uh, stopping by again. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please drop a like and uh, consider subscribing. Until next time, peace.